you know, so, you know, it is truly, uh, you know, we talk about in a time of pandemic, there has been tremendous conversation about the disruption that we've seen in supply chain and to end. I've seen a lot of narratives about blaming lean being the cause of supply chain. And of course, that is far from being true. In fact, I would propose that the lean had absolutely nothing to do with the supply chain disruption. And there's a lot of other variables we can talk about. But with that being sort of an underpinning, uh, ASQ, American Society of Quality, Lean Division, and Center for Global Supply Chain Management, we had thought about how do we continue to promote the practices of lean in supply chain because everything we do, movement of goods, services, data, all driven with a lot of friction. And I'm proud to have that Lean Excellence Recognition Award and support from ASQ, support from Lean Division, and support from my good friend, Chris, Lindsay, Frank, uh, Lens, and many others in the back end to really bring this conversation up front. So Chris, I will pass this over to you. Well, thank you, Nick. I appreciate that. And, and we love you as well. We, uh, we couldn't think of anybody better to work with. So first off, I'd like to say how extremely delighted I am to be here again this year to participate in this amazing event, even virtually. This it has been and continues to be one of my favorite summits, uh, and I go to a lot of them. So thank you, Nick, uh, Dennis, Marvie, Ruth, the entire summit staff support team in the background. We know how hard you work to make this wonderful, and this year is, is no exception. Well, in some ways, it seems like it was just yesterday that the words supply chain were just buzzwords in the purchasing arenas. Uh, today, most savvy executives realize that the supply chain is really a critical element in achieving business performance improvement goals. The USC Marshall Center for Global Supply Chain Management has been instrumental in bringing that awareness to businesses across the globe. And, um, and as well, educating our next generation of supply chain professionals. For people passionate about business improvement, ASQ is recognized as the global knowledge network that links the best ideas, the best tools, the best experts up and down our supply chains. And our members are some of all of you, so experts in many different arenas, including those at USC. Uh, with over 60,000 members in 130 countries and a history that dates back to 1946, so a lot of years, ASQ has become the global standard in quality leadership in almost every country in the world through its global advocacy, collaboration, education, um, as well as our certifications and our research. I speak on behalf of ASQ's Lean Enterprise Division as their past chair and as a personal promoter of lean integration um, into the supply chain. So when I say how proud I am to once again co-sponsor co and present this year's Lean Excellence Award, I, it, I really mean that from my heart. So the Lean Excellence Award recognizes, for those of you that aren't aware of it, recognizes organizations that demonstrate outstanding achievement in lean, lean, uh, lean supply chain, practices and who foster a lean culture within their industry and organization. This year's award recipient is an organization that needs almost no introduction to most overall, let alone in the world of supply chain and lean, representing and accepting for Intel's wireless communication solutions, wireless platform manufacturing, is Russ Snyder. He is mobile wireless group manager, module operations. We recognize Russ and his team at Intel for their work in applying lean throughout the supply chain, um, including 44 lean projects that resulted in over 100 million in savings, increased flexibility, reduced throughput time, and inventories, as well as the ability to sustain and recover delivery performance very quickly during this COVID supply chain outage. We are very proud to recognize him and honored to present him with this award. Russ, congratulations. And uh, this is, uh, you can see it, you can feel it or touch it, but it <laughs> will be shipped to your home address. Once again, congratulations to you, your team, and Intel as a whole. Thank you. Uh, it is quite an honor to be recognized among so many exceptional leaders and speakers at this conference. 
Uh, I've come to know so much more about the, uh, the business school at USC and the supply chain management school. It's, uh, it's great to learn about. A special thanks to Nick Bias and the team in the USC Global Supply Chain Summit and Chris Hayes, especially uh, for, for leading ASQ leader enterprise division team. Uh, one thing, as I will agree with Nick, that Lean actually helped us be more flexible and more resilient in COVID recovery. Um, you know, our team, to give you some idea, our team at Intel is responsible for manufacturing the Intel Wi-Fi modules. It's a global supply chain across five or six different countries in Asia. And this recognition really goes to my team who has exhibited a lot of creativity in not only doing some traditional lean work within the factories, but uh, to elevate lean combined with, with some uh, optimized supply chain principles such as delayed differentiation to come up with a much more agile, more cost-effective and shorter throughput time for our supply chain. Um, you know, just one more thanks to my team and another thanks to this forum who's given us this award. Thank you so much. Congratulations, Russell and uh, Intel as well. Well done.